Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, I see some stuff. Let's see, Let's see what we got up in here, y'all. Uh, got anything good? Finally got my new shoes. Y'all dig them? Alright. Steel toe, puncture proof, all that good stuff. bit of scrap right here uh, these guys the yard told me not to bring these but man there's enough there's enough here I think there's enough here me personally I mean look at all that there's plenty of scrap in there I'm gonna take them apart a little bit. Get a little, a little bit more to a piece of the scrapyard. This bag's heavy. we go some. one of those scanner deals over here Power cord. All right. these guys big old piece of cast aluminum on there all right. that's all plastic 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 There's a bag full of stuff right here. Usually I don't be taking the whole bag. Right, we'll grab it, go through it. I see boards and it's like drives and stuff, so. We'll pilfer through it. Water. bit of stuff here bag of goodies to go through I can dig it can you All right. scrappity scrap some of those face masks again but what I've come to find out those have all been open oh this is that dumpster it sure is. Oh, let's see here. We know what, what this is. Yeah, baby. Let's see a cord in here. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with those masks. I grabbed them last time and it's just like, after going through them, they've all been open. And I know what it is. They've been open just to be tried on or something. Maybe. I mean, that's what I'm kind of assuming. Oh, there goes another one. Uh, 
that looks to be about it. It's just a bunch of empty boxes of stuff. Okay. All right. <sighs> Try to hit it kind of hard this evening too. There's some rain moving in. It's supposed to get nasty tonight. It stay nasty for a couple days, so. <sighs> gotta make it happen. We gotta whip it. Whip it good. Check out that, y'all. Oh, that's all plastic. That's all plastic. Man, that'd be a pretty decent dumpster score. But no, it's plastic. What's up, it's a Barney dumpster, y'all. See some doors. It's a closer on there. Oh, yeah, I got something for you. All right, everybody, run. Mikey's got an axe. All right. All right. All right. So, yeah, I heard about the whole toboggle with the lumber, all the comments. People let me know what's up. And uh, it's funny, I did look it up, and it's a combination of a lot of things. People say COVID, you know, mill shut down housing boom wood shortage and then my wife said she saw a video where there's a truck driver who actually hauls lumber and he says that the mills he goes to never shut down and that there's no shortage but someone's buying it all up creating a demand for it and i'm like hmm i don't trust our politicians just enough to to do some crap like that so yeah it's possible Alrighty. There we go. Right. Yep, that's aluminum. Good stuff. Let's see if uh, if there's anything on this door over here. Ugh. Nope. They took it. They took it. They took it. Ugh. Let's see. Ugh. They took it all, baby. I'll go. All right. Ugh. We got a little bit, little bit there. Anyways, it's moving along. Got to go in beast mode. Rain's coming. Cool. I see a little bit. See what we got up in here. What the heck is that a Margaritaville? Nope, that's a shark. There's a little scrap here. Nothing but small stuff. Probably not worth having jumped in for it, but we jumped in for it. So, since we're in here, might as well make the most of it. It just looks like regular old iron steel. Some funky clothes. Dirty clothes. Uh, okay. Couple bolts. Nuts and bolts. Let's grab that. Alright. Gotta have your nuts and bolts. Yeah. Yeah. All right, I see some conduit. Let's see what we got here. A little bit of scrap right there. Get us a little box going. Oh, that box ain't gonna work. Look at this box here. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. And it's got wire in it. I 
don't feel like it. Is what it is. Stainless right there. In the case. Yep, look at that. Some more drill bits for my collection. That's the number one wire right there. Big old chunk of copper right there. Gotta kind of dig around for it. But it's here. It's definitely in here. It's a good wire right in here. Get that a whole roll of electrical tape. Somebody clean out their truck again. That's all right by me. Get that with some more. Numero uno. Got here, y'all. Breaker of some sort. Some more wire down here. And more right there. Free money in the garbage. Standing on anything over here. That don't look like a whole lot. Alright. Oh man, we got us a box of scrap right here. Yeah, baby. Just gotta dig for it. But it's there. Ooh, ooh, watch your head. Watch your head. All right, get up out of here. Good stuff, it's the front. More spools of stuff. I know, I'm, somebody's gonna scream at me for not taking the spools. I already know it, I already know it. What is this? What is this? Ah, it's stuck down underneath this piece of wood here. What it is? I don't know. It looks pretty cool. Yeah, those are pretty decent little spools. You know what spools are here for? A stepping stool. <laughs> look at that. Ooh, look at that, I got some wire. Sweet. Oh, geez, y'all, it's starting to rain. Ooh, those look like aluminum. Let's see. Geez, I wouldn't be jumping in for such small stuff. Uh, if it were steel, but aluminum. That's exactly what that is. That's all extruded. Oh, so I'll be jumping in for that. That ain't shads up. Yeah, it's starting to rain. Hopefully it doesn't start pouring too hard. Uh, I don't have to cut her short, you know? Maybe it gets too nasty, you know? Is what it is. All right, aluminum, yeah! Oh. That's kind of cool, huh? I guess I can take it as by the trash. I'll take it out for the casters. Could use that little dolly. Ugh. Getting all wet. Look at this guy. It's a frogman. What's up, Mr. Frogman on the wall? I wish I had your powers and capabilities. Very cool. That's one of them big old leaping frogs. Oh my gosh, I could already see stuff in here, man. It's a jackpot. 
Golly, dude, this is just after a couple of days. We already came back, man. What up? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna back her up like we did last time. Ugh. Just makes no sense of all this, but holy jeez, Louise, man, man, I am the biggest fan of this dumpster right here. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that's a big old piece of copper right there. Somebody likes me. There goes another one. This this is what this is what it's all about right here. This is that is what you want. That is what you want. Alright. All right. These are all the boxes I got from last time. I've already stripped them all down. So we'll just pile these on top. Golly, these guys have been busy. They've been keeping me busy. One of these days I'm gonna poke my head in there and thank them all. Alright. But then they'll be like, oh, you're the guy? <laughs> nah, probably not. They know something. What's going on? They're being cool. Leaving me all the good scrap. And I thank them for it from the bottom of my heart. All right. All right. This aluminum stuff here. There's a big old project bag. And it's full of stuff. I'll just grab the whole bag. Alright. Yeah. This is amazing amazing on all levels we got two bags to go through when we get back oh, oh it's disgusting out here though it's just getting gross all right. that bag's nice and light so we're not even gonna mess with it wire copper that big heavy gauge copper wire though that's that's what I'm after that is that's the high dollar stuff right there I'm trying to not have to throw all this crap out being that I was just in here the other day, I'm thinking down towards the bottom is where I've always already been. And then people are asking me about what I do with the, the breakers. I really, to be honest with you, I have been throwing them in the shred while I was. I've been kind of collecting them. I mean, I know how to take them apart and there's definitely some stuff in there. But, uh, I mean, is it worth it on these smaller ones? I know these bigger breakers, or the bigger breakers, yeah. I take those apart. Those are definitely worth it. Some snippets. Those are definitely worth it. But the smaller ones. But I did read... I'm gonna ask the guy at the scrapyard if they buy them. I was reading up, there's a website called like sell your breaker or, or something like that, that they'll buy them, but it's like, dude, it's gonna cost a boatload to ship them and they get heavy too. Or maybe find someone locally who will refurbish them or look at all that. You know, refurbish or uh, Something like that, kind of maybe bulk or something. Uh, I don't know, but yes, the bigger ones I definitely take apart because they're most definitely worth it. The small ones, you basically got to crack them open with a hammer because they're like riveted shut. 
so it's like you know I, mean, I guess if you got the the time you know go for it but But I am gonna ask the guys at Scrapyard if they take them, if they buy them, give you a special price. Uh, odds are probably not, but you never know. You never know. You never know. Okay. All right. Let's just kind of go uh, some more. They definitely replace a lot of electrical boxes here. And I know for a fact that like all those breakers, they can't all be bad, you know? Let's pour that way. Uh, I'm grabbing these because sometimes, although these don't look like it, they're aluminum, especially if it's exterior lighting and such, but we'll check them out. But it's not looking that way. I'm gonna grab it anyway. I'll get that, that off the thorough. All right. All right. More pee jugs. And this looks like, I feel like, so I was just here a couple of days. I know down at the bottom. Probably hit it pretty good. Just trying to do a quick little gander here. It's a little bit of some it's there. I think we got the good the good stuff. The good big stuff. Give us some water. Ooh! Haven't got it all. Look at this. Look at this y'all. Some more thick copper. Some Romex. I'll just empty this bag in the shirt because it's not that full but it's definitely got some good wires in it yes it do some cast aluminum actually you know what we can and now I got bags at home. Alright. Piece of copper there. A little bit of wire here. Not much. Little jingle punch out from the new boxes. The wires in. And I am starting to sweat like a pig. It's so humid out. Just disgusting. Typical. Muggy, oh, really muggy heat tonight. All right. Now that's a lick, a lick and a half. Oh yeah. All right. And we got got a couple of bags to go through. This is that one we found. It's got computer stuff in it, I think. And then this guy over here is gonna be full of more electronic stuff. So, man, man, hold up. Way too much lean in my cup. All right. All right. And since this is supposed to rain, we'll be super nice. Shut it for him. And then remember when I got here, this thing was busting out over the top. Like just, we've definitely like, we've knocked it down quite a bit just with that scrap. Holy, holy moly. Oh. That is some good scrapping, son. Yeah. Oh, I, uh, hmm. Let's check that Honeywell box. Yeah, there's something in that Honeywell box. All right. Let's hop on in, huh? All right, let's see what we got in this box. It's another box. Alright, so we got under here. What is it? Power wireless low profile access point. Oh there's a that's got a little scratch on the bottom there. Hurrah! 
It's an access point. I believe they call that a, a bunghole. <sighs> when you're in the can. Oh. Bungee cord. Oh, yeah. No hook on the bungee cord. Okay. Whoa. 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 What we got here, man? It's like slot machine stuff. I like slots. What Beavis say? He likes slots. Likes lots of slots. Ugh. Come on, man. Empty your. Uh, empty your. Uh, or flatten your boxes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Making me work. Ooh, I see something. Is that a computer? I think we got pooters, y'all. Let's see here. Some wires. <sighs> yes, sir. HP and it's heavy. It's heavy. I can tell it's got the it's a hard drive in it. There's another one down here. Let's see. I'm gonna improvise a little bit, maybe. This is, this is a dumpster that's got these really sharp edges. And when you lean over on it, it really digs into your gut, man. It's not comfortable. <sighs> but that's not working very well. We might have to get in. All right, let's see. You know me, I'll be getting in for computers. <sighs> I'll always get in for a computer. Oh, there's a few of them in here. We got a few of them. There goes one. That's right there. There's another one. We'll come around on the other side and pick them up. There goes another one. Oh. There goes another one. There's another one. Man, it's another jackpot. Computer jackpot, baby. And we got here one, two, one, two, six, seven. That one out there makes eight. The wires. Get us a little box going here. Ah, what we've we been sipping on? Fireball. That stuff's all right, I guess. Not much. First choice. Oh, look at that. There's another one. There's nine. Nine computers thus far. Let's stick this out here. Nine computers, huh? Oh, I see another one. There's ten. Ugh, ten computers. Scrabbity scrab. Man, ten computers, huh? I can dig it. I can dig it. I can dig it. She can dig it. He can dig it. We can dig it. Dig it. Dig it. Dig it. Dig it. Glance around here. This carpet. I don't see nothing else. Down there. There's the bottom. Alright. 
What we say? 10? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 10 computers, man. With all the stuff. Check over here. Uh, okay. All right. Let's see no more. Look at my shoes. My shoes are getting dirty. My new shoes. All right. Look at this. Ooh, look at that. Bunch of wires. All right, let's hop up in this one with the toilet. Oh. With the wooden blind. It's a badminton. Oh, is that it, man? I thought we were gonna hit another one. I thought it's a trampoline. I don't see the rail, the the, the bars, and the throne. Ooh. Nice. Noise! <sighs> oh my. Ten pooters. <sighs> Alright, let me just bag the truck up and get him. Come on, Pooters. Get you home before it starts raining. Before it really starts raining. It's supposed to start here in the next couple hours. All right. Those look like little workstations, like for the office. But they didn't even pull the hard drives out. But I mean, they say 2015 on them. They're old, so probably ain't nothing really too exciting. But uh, my electronics guy, he even said like, you know, I was like, dude, like I put a lot of trust in him. And he even told me, he's like, he's like, look, man, first thing I do is I wipe these hard drives. I don't, you know, he doesn't like, he's not like that. He's a good guy. He ain't gonna try to like look for other people's pertinent information. And that kind of stuff, you know, he's, he's a good dude, so I trust him. Oh, oops. All right. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. It's a lot of computers. A lot of computers. No, don't fall down there. Don't go down there. Yep, 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 yep. All right. All right. All right. We got one more over here. Oh, ah, watch your head. Watch your head. All right. That's going to go with that. Going to go there. And then our, our scrap over here. I'm just going to dump it. Oh, look at all these extra boxes. And we can't forget our badminton racket. Yeah, wires. All right. Y'all say we call it a night. I think we good. <laughs> I know we're good. Golden, baby. Well, all righty, scavengers. I'd say that is a very, 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 very successful evening out there getting some stuff. Definitely got our fill of scrap in the uh, electrical dumpster again. Got some decent copper wire back there. Like some decent stuff. But I think I done buried it all. Oh, here's a piece. Ugh. 
like that is some good stuff what is that like two gauge yep two gauge t-h-h-n-2 i think that's what it says yeah two gauge put that in the stripper this is the stuff i strip i strip this stuff all day long this smaller stuff right here uh i just scrapped that out it's number one it's definitely less than the bare bright copper but that crap is hard to strip got some more over here a little bit smaller but that is going to be stripped too the Romex, we're going to strip that down. There's a piece of Bear Bright, two pieces of number one in there. And then we got all these boxes. Got a couple of the oxygen machine, more wires, the aluminum wires, which they put as neoprene, the uh, the boxes, where we talked about those, fuses, or the, the breakers, like aluminum, like all kinds of ish. 10 computers. Boy, it's been a while since I found a computer, man. Or, I mean, like, a computer, you know, computer, like, lick like that, you know. Onesies, twosies here and there, but to find 10, boom. Dig it, dig it, dig it. But as promised, we're going to go through these bags for y'all. Go ahead and knock that out real quick. My light, I think, is about to go dim. Uh, I don't know the exact name of this type of box here, but these are easy to strip. Uh, these are going to be... Uh, you know you pop these out and you've got aluminum right here aluminum right here and then this is what the yard calls a uh, uh, 6061 it's like you know from bar stock or big thick plate stuff right there these pieces right here you uh pop these off those are copper right there those little pieces right there's there's some metal inside that you know you can just kind of it just slides right out but the outer pieces those are copper they're coated so it's number two as it sits but yeah that's super easy to take apart right there all day long, son. All right. Let's see, we got more boxes here. What's in the box? She don't want to open up. Oh, yeah, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Yeah, just a little breaker box. Got some wires in there. A little bit of aluminum. Clean that sucker up. Iron stuff. Iron stuff. Let's see here. Got the trash. Let's dump her out here. And I'll use this bag to uh, line my trash can I got here. Oh my gosh, look at all that wire. Uh, all right. Got our trash can right here. Put our contractor bag. Uh, it's a little bit smaller, but we can still use it here. Go ahead. Nutter butter, man. I love me some nutter butter. All right, that's all stripped out. Look at that. There's some there's some more thick copper wire. That's probably like six gauge, eight gauge. It's a little bit smaller than that other stuff we just saw. I, all the writing has been wiped off of it. Nope, four gauge. Four gauge, okay. Huh, interesting. Yeah, got some wires here. This stuff, I'll, I'll strip this stuff. That's thick enough to, for me to strip. Some big Romex here. Uh, more big Romex there. Some trash, 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 trash. Yeah, these contractor bags are awesome. That's gonna be trash. Some Romex number one. And trash there. This right here, that's gonna be aluminum. I think. Pretty sure that's aluminum. All right. It's trash, trash. Got some number one wire here. Lots of Romex to add to the stuff. Iron scrap right there. A little piece of copper there. More Romex. Trash, trash. What we got here? Klein. Klein's legit. That's for cutting sheetrock. I don't know why that ended up in the trash. It looks like being pretty good shape. Uh, more Romex. Trash, 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 trash. Like Forky. Forky. I just watched the Toy Story 4, and they got the little character named Forky. I get the biggest kick out of him because he's like trash. He wants to be in the trash. More electrical tape. More Romex. So all in all, it's not too bad right there slide this on over and then this one looked a little bit grosser so 
we're not gonna dump it out. We're just gonna go through it. But it looks like there's lots of boards in here. Yeah, it's electronic boards. See, there's trash. Lots of electronic boards. This looks like a motherboard, maybe. Yep. All right. There's a scanner. Yeah, there's not a whole lot happening in here. Just e-scrap, computer scrap. Big old heavy piece of something right there. Got some wires here. A mouse. A little bit more scrap there. Little boards and such here. And then the boards. I give them to the uh, electronics guy if he wants them. Sometimes the boards are just crap, but I think some of these he'd probably be interested in. Um, I don't know what that is. It's got some metal on it. And then that looks almost about it. Got some charger cord there. Just junk, 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 junk. Okay, so yeah. Not a whole lot in that one, mostly just trash, but I saw some stuff in there, so we went ahead and grabbed it anyway, just to, uh, you know, just to be sure. Our number one there. And then I'll, I'll come through it, I'll clean this stuff up tomorrow. Although it's supposed to be raining, but, you know, move the, move the computers and such in the garage. But anyways, like I said, very successful evening and I'm very stoked about it. Uh, that is going to do it on this episode of Dumpster Diving. Uh, as always, it was a total pleasure. I appreciate y'all tagging along. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, uh, Instagram, check it out. I got one. Uh, the uh, notification bell, hit it so you can stay up to date with what I got uh, and what we found. And uh, yeah, all that good stuff. Uh, uh, extra special shout out there by Buster Merch. Appreciate that, guys. There's down below Teespring. Get y'all some stuff. Support the scavenger. And. Uh, yeah, so like I said, we got some rain coming in tonight. It's supposed to rain for the next couple of days. So it could be a couple of days before we get back out there. I don't know. I don't know. If it clears out, we get a little break in the weather. Maybe I can get out, you know, sneak out there and uh, try to, you know, bang a little one out for you guys. But uh, that's going to do it on this one. Um, yeah. So uh, I hope you all enjoy it. I hope you all did enjoy it. And uh, yeah. So until that next one, y'all be safe. Be awesome and all that good stuff. And I'll be looking for you on that next one. Whew. Yeah. What we got here, y'all?